Hi, I'm Susan Joy Schlieff. Someone left a request on my Facebook page recently on PowerPoint Queen Rules asking about what kind of camera to get for recording informal tip videos for her business. So I wanted to make a quick video in response. I personally like just using my iPhone. I believe in the theory I've heard someone else say that the best camera to use is the one that you have with you and we all have our smart smartphones with us. So to me that's the top choice. But the one thing that you can do to improve the quality of your videos from a smartphone is to use an external microphone. I'm using one that's plugged into my phone and it's a lapel mic with a long cord, but there are others that are just little uh, plug-in mics that fit right on the phone that uh, don't have to attach to you. And then there are also cordless lapel mics as well, so there's a wide variety of external microphones you can get to improve the sound quality from your videos. And the sound quality is really the biggest thing that people notice if it's not good. So that would be my first suggestion. And then if you really do want to get a new camera, there are a couple of things I would consider. One is, where are you most likely to shoot your videos? One of the things I love about using my phone is that I can take it anywhere and record. Um, I have actually two mics that I can plug in and at an event and do a quick video interview with someone else. I can take it to the Botanic Gardens and record a video there if I want. If you're more likely to shoot videos in your office or at your desk, then you don't have to worry about that. The question is to look at where are you going to be most likely to use the equipment to get the most videos recorded. So if you have the space in your office to set up a little studio and keep it up all the time, then you might want to get a boom mic on a stand. If you don't have room for that, then get a little studio mic, uh, doesn't have to be an expensive one, something that sits on your desktop, and then you can record in that. But it really comes down to how you're going to get the most, the most videos made and what equipment is going to serve your needs to do that. And then of course you have to consider your budget. So good luck with choosing a new camera and I look forward to seeing some videos from you online. If you have any questions that you'd like to get answered about video marketing or visual content marketing, please leave a question on my Facebook page, PowerPoint Queen Rules. Um, we all have our smart, smart, we all have our smart, smart, um, uh,